Douglas here at TV8 News.
version of Guiding Light is presented by new Tide with grease releasers. If it's got to be clean, it's got to be Tide. It's not only tough to make a dollar these days, it's tough to keep it. I know how hard my husband works. He's always in a hurry, always on the run, always going, and he gets very dirty. My job is seeing that we keep some of the money. I bought this so-called bargain detergent. It didn't work. Two washes in a bargain powder can't get this greasy food stain as clean as just one wash in Tide. If you have to wash it twice, what kind of savings is that? If it's got to be clean, it's got to be Tide. I want to do the best I can do for my family. We're a team. I'm too sick to go in. So take Dayquil. My head aches. <laughs> so take Dayquil. This won't have my cough. Nope. Take Vicks Dayquil, the non-drowsy, stuffy, head, congested chest, sore throat, coughing fever, so you can face your day medicine. I was blown away when my dentist told me I had tartar. The doctor, I said, I use regular baking soda toothpaste. My teeth feel clean. Jakey said, it's not enough. Use new tartar control crest with baking soda, and your teeth will be cleaner. Now you can get the clean feeling of baking soda and proven tartar control from Crest in a toothpaste that prevents tartar better than regular baking soda toothpaste. So I brushed with tartar control crest with baking soda, and my next visit's great. I finally cleaned up my act. A smart choice from the dentist's choice. Memorable. Marvelous. One in a million. Navy. You always feel perfect in Navy. The clean, classic fragrance by CoverGirl. Turn the arrow to open. Oh, no. Turn the arrow. This is ridiculous. Pain relievers can be a pain to get into. I hate this. I can't do it. My thumb hurts. Turn the arrow. I don't think so. So the makers of Tylenol introduced the patented Fast Cap Package. So easy to open, it's commended by the Arthritis Foundation. I'm amazed. Is this pie? Good cap. Oh, the new ah. fast cap. One, two, three. Like I said, ease is fine. Only from Tylenol, the powerful pain reliever that's not a pain to open. Not for homes with young children. the bomb, but he was involved with the person who did. Why? I don't know why. I haven't put those pieces together, but Alan Michael is definitely involved in this. So he was somehow connected to the woman who was hurt. Or, or, or she, she, it could have been an accident just like it was with me, and he was after someone else. Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. I... I can't believe that Alan Michael's involved in this. I was married to him, Mallet. I know. I hate it when I think about that. It just... It makes me sick. It hurts me. I know, I know. I'm so glad that you're here for me when I came home all day. I've been kicking myself for fighting with you this morning. We, we shouldn't fight anymore yeah, like that. Things got way out of hand. I, 
I blame myself. I was... I'm sorry. No, no, no. You were discouraged and... and you're exhausted. I know you didn't mean any of the things that you said. Or did you? I think you're slipping. I am? What? Where? <laughs> Well, I would have thought you'd been more than a match for Henry. <laughs> then you underestimate the man. Mm-mm. Mm. No, no, I did that once, never again. But after all, you are a woman. Mm-hmm, and he is a wonderful man. Terrific dancer, too. You danced with him? Mm-hmm. It was absolutely magic. He was this close to drinking champagne out of my shoe. Now, wait a minute. Wait a minute. A second ago, you were drawing a picture of this horrible old coot who was ordering you off the premises with a shotgun. No, I never said that. I said that he was nervous, very concerned about me having sudden interest in old license plates. Do you know that he conveniently misplaced the picture that I gave him, the one with the man in the car? And I have reason to believe that he also tore out sheets from a ledger that would prove my father's connection to Spalding. I can't get him to admit to any of it, though. But he has a very guilty glint in his eye. Well, it could be that glint was lust. Now, how long do you suppose it's been since a sweet young thing such as yourself has <laughs> slipped into Henry's arms for a quick tango? Well, I don't really know. <laughs> No, it was definitely guilt. I can tell the difference between lust and all the other deadly sins. Oh, you tell me about it. It's your stock and trade. Mm. Are you jealous? Oh, definitely. Really? Next time I see Henry, he's going to be in big trouble. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. I might challenge him to, uh, I don't know, arm wrestling or something. <laughs> That's naughty. <laughs> but, you know, this is a bit intriguing, isn't it? I mean, if he's really seriously dodging your little investigation, could be he has something to hide could concerning be. Spalding. Mm -hmm. I think you ought to keep on this. Really go for it. You got my full support. Mm -hmm. I think I might. I think we better go. Mm -hmm. We'll come back soon. I would like to tell Blake that Ross Marler, of all people, is not worth her tears. But thanks to you, she and I are no longer speaking. What do you mean, thanks to me? Oh, come on, Ross. You knew that would be one of the consequences of this whole thing when you started out. But of course, that didn't stop you. You went for the excitement, for youth by association. So thanks to your precious ego, she has lost what family she had. And now, because it's politically expedient, you decide, out she goes. That is not true, Holly. I begged you to drop your vendetta against Blake. I didn't want any of this. I hate what's happened. You hate... Your life is nothing but hate. And you will stop at nothing, even the public humiliation of your own child in a newspaper you wouldn't use to line up letterbox. Are you accusing me of something? Why be so oblique? But you better be careful what you say. You can't prove it. If you don't think it's obvious who gave those photographs to the Inquisitor, you're more deluded than I thought you were. You're getting very good at this, Mr. Would-be Senator. The old, if attacked, attack back, and maybe they'll forget what you asked in the first place. Well, I have a very long memory, and one thing I will not forget is how you drop Blake at the first sign of trouble. I had no idea you were such a coward. You should know about cowardice, Holly. I mean, if you thought those photographs of Blake and me were so newsworthy, why didn't you put them on the air at WSPR? You didn't, because you'd be accused of sleazy tabloid journalism. So much better to give it to a sleazy tabloid. Let them take the hits. Even lately. Compared to you, Roger's starting to look pretty good. Blake would agree with you. According to Roger, she's trying to get back in his good graces as we speak. Yeah, well, that's a mistake. Yeah, well. For once, I think I can understand it. I mean, when you have been hurt as deeply as she has, you want to prove to yourself that there is at least one man who won't abandon you. So I think she'd do pretty much anything to get back on Roger's side. Doesn't bode too well for you, Senator. Nor for you. Well, at least I'm not running for office. By the way, how does it feel to lose the vote of the woman you're sleeping with? Ready for a showdown? Roll up.
Introducing Showdown Yahtzee, the first Yahtzee board game with all the hot Yahtzee action, plus stealing points and a final showdown round. Showdown Yahtzee, we're having a Yahtzee good time. Take American cheese, make it wrapped. You got a new idea for a tasty mm. kid snack. Wrap an apple with American cheese and your kids will cheer. Because any snack with American cheese gets you a big pat on the mm. back. American cheese, the snack kids love to eat. Why is the doughboy tooting his own horn? It's Pillsbury Baked Tops. A jazzy way to top your cake before it bakes. First, the crumbly chocolate streusel bakes in. Then, the dangerously delicious glaze drizzles on, which means you can serve it while it's still hot. Cool. Pillsbury Baked Tops. Oh, they'll blow you away. I dreaded this visit to the doctor. I had, um, I had stomach problems. You know, more chalky medicine to take. I mean, just getting it down is... <laughs> but what my doctor told me about really blew my mind. New Mylanta Gel Caps. Introducing the antacid with absolutely no chalky taste. New Mylanta Gel Caps. Potent antacid relief now in an easy-to-swallow gel cap. New Mylanta Gel Caps. My doctor said Mylanta. These are the curls, girls. Caruso curls. Salon perfect curls that stay bouncy all day. With the Caruso molecular hair setter, moisturizing steam gives you long-lasting curls and waves. Gently, quickly, easily, without damage from hot curlers and irons. So have your Caruso curls. And keep them all day with the Caruso molecular hair setter. Especially at this point in your career. 
Mr. Ross, may I make a suggestion? Henry, please, whatever lecture you're tempted to give, spare me. It's not a lecture, just two words. Two words? Okay. Private practice. Would you put some scotch in this, please? about me tonight. Doesn't look like such a great dancer to me. Oh, looks can be very deceiving. Uh, men like Henry, well, they went to dancing school as part of their education. And boys are trained to grow up to be gentlemen. They're taught manners, style, charm. I can imagine that his study must be filled with oak-lined bookcases with first editions and cut glass decanters. Have you ever seen it? Uh, um, his study? Well, any part of the Chamberlain House. I'm sure you've been there more than once or twice. No. Matter of fact, I haven't. Why? Only good, healthy things grow in Mrs. Dash's garden, where Mrs. Dash has created a salt-free blend of 14 herbs and spices that give food a livelier, zestier flavor. Mrs. Dash, a garden of flavors in six varieties instead of salt. What can the ocean spray cranberry do that no other taste can do? Bow, bow, bow. Ocean spray cran drinks. It's amazing what a little cran can do. Bow, bow, bow. Introducing a whole new way to keep that shower fresh feeling all day. New band Fresh and Dry. Mm. Keep the feeling. Fresh and Dry has an extra wide ball. It's a big way to roll on fresh, a big way to roll on dry. Band Fresh and Dry has aloe, too. It's a whole new way to stay shower fresh. Keep that feeling, shower fresh feeling. New Band Fresh and Dry. This is Scrutinize. It's a game where you find as many things that start with the same letter in pictures like these. Football, a fountain, a flounder, uh, a fan. No, just dry flounder. It's also a game you'll really get into. Pajamas, a Pomeranian. Carrot? Vermil, Pikmin. Mez? A flag. There's a blue. And a pants. Ready for round two? Okay, now. Honey, this is the flounder, okay? Play Scrutinize. 24 pictures, thousands of images. Keep rolling, rolling, rolling. Get those flavors flowing. The taste has got you going. It's wild. It's a stampede of taste. Smile and open wide. Old El Paso's got the taste that runs wild. Pour them on, eat them up, eat them up. Pour them on, pour them on, eat them up. Open wide. Higher mile, tasting wild. Old El Paso's got the taste that runs wild. happening to these old folks is a crying shame, and you won't believe who's doing it. And all new Street Stories returns tonight. This is CBS. It's the incredible shrinking bedroom. Honey? It's what happens when you run out of storage space. Honey? And the walls start closing in. So what's the answer? A 12-drawer underdresser from Big Sur Waterbeds. Right now, just $3.99 buys any of these waterbeds with 12 drawers of underbed storage, the equivalent of two upright dressers under your bed. Or buy the 12 drawers with any bed for $1.99 and save yourself from the horror of the incredible shrinking bedroom. Big Sur Waterbeds. After examining, testing, it's a fact. You can buy new Preparation H hydrocortisone cream with the maximum strength available without a prescription to relieve problem itch. New Preparation H hydrocortisone cream. Prescription strength without a prescription. Every second of an asthma attack can feel like an eternity. That's why there's Primatine Mist. Primatine opens clogged breathing tubes fast when speed counts. Primatine Mist. Fastest type asthma relief without a prescription. This compact disc, stereo, and dual cassette player is yours for only $4.99 when you rent any other item at Renter's Choice, your home furnishing outlets. Heidi Saladin on today's TV8. I have dinner ready in a 
you if you want. Why don't you guys just make yourself comfortable? Yeah, Nadine, um, what are you, what are you doing here? You running a chop shop? Oh, I'm sorry. Let me just get this stuff out of here. Oh, no, 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 no. I'll pick it up. I'll, I'll be happy to, but just tell me what it is. I think it's a crib. Well, aren't you smart? I said that boy had mechanical aptitude. Well, I mean, it's pretty obvious. Well, it wasn't obvious to me. Nothing's obvious to me when you have to figure out how to put it together. I've been working on that thing for four solid hours, and I couldn't figure it out. Of course, Bill, you know, maybe you could if you got your daddy to help you. Especially when you both think that, that pretty soon you're going to have a little brother or a little sister looking through those bars at you, reaching out a, a little hand to hold you. And... That baby is going to think you hung the moon. You've never been a big brother before, have you? He's going to be idolized, isn't he? No, I, I wouldn't be surprised. So what do you say? You want to get started in uh, making things ready for our little stranger? Can't wait. <laughs> A letter. I haven't been able to communicate very well lately. I thought if I put it down on paper. Yes, I would rather read that you were leaving me than come home to an empty house and have to figure it out for myself. Harley, I, I wasn't leaving you. It wasn't like that. No, you were packing bags and you were going to go out that door. That sounds like you were leaving me. It's not me. like I'm giving up on the relationship, Harley. Just a living together part for now. Or for a while. Look, I'm going to have to learn to do everything all over again. And, uh, I'm not fit to live with anyone. Why don't you let me be the judge of that? Because you're a lousy judge. You have a high threshold for pain, and then I'm tired of pushing that to the limit. And I was afraid you'd end up hating me. I've told you so many times that's not going to happen. Not unless you, not unless you start leaving me notes instead of talking to me about things. I'm sorry. I just thought it was the best way. Where were you going to go? Edith has a client that was moving out of a ground floor apartment by the hospital. I thought I'd go take a look at it. Please don't. Harley, it's not like we won't see each other. I'm only going to be a few blocks away. No, it's not that. It's just... We already did that. But that's, that's not good enough now. Not for what we've become. We have been through so much together, and that changes a relationship. We can't go back to dating. Do you understand? Yeah. We can't go back. We can go forwards, or we can end the relationship, but we can't go back. Okay. Okay, what? Okay, I'll stay and make your life miserable. I'm sorry for selling us short. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I didn't make you feel like a bigger part of the investigation. Yeah. Well, wait. You can change all that right now. Tell me more about the Alan Michael thing. Okay. Um, oh. <laughs> well, there's not much. I mean, once we get the French woman, we can make an arrest. Make an arrest? Okay, listen, Harley, there can't be any slip-ups or mistakes on this arrest. I mean, if you leave even a pinhole for some lawyer to crawl through, Alan Michael, I guarantee, will go back to that Armani lifestyle. Oh, there's not going to be much of a life left for Alan Michael. He is going to lose everything. He'll lose... The company, he'll lose his trust funds. He's going to lose Eleni when she finds out. Wait, wait, Eleni doesn't know about this? Don't let her find out, because if she tips him off, he'll go so far underground, we'll never dig him up. And, and, and we can't tell Frank, either. Keeping this from them is not going to be as difficult as keeping this from Alan Michael. He's sniffing around at everything, always offering to help. And what about me? Oh, I, what do I do when I just feel like freaking out and slamming him up against a wall? Maybe it sounds like you need something to distract all your aggression. Maybe I can help. Yeah. How? Just.
stashed in the house somewhere. All I need is a floor plan. Sure. Well, you know, th there must be a convenience store open now. Uh, if you order a large soda with your nachos, they'll throw in a Chamberlain House floor plan free of charge, I'm sure. I probably don't need a floor plan after all. All I really need to do is to talk to someone who's been inside. Someone who's less of a pariah who's been invited. Hmm. Ah, here's Leo. I have to have a word with him. Would you excuse me? Think of something else wicked to say until he turns. Our very own two-fisted, hard-hitting man of justice. Romping around in his skivvies with a schoolgirl, Ross, you absolutely made my day. <laughs> I'm here to please, Jenna. Good. Excuse me. <laughs> well, thanks for letting Michelle come to the dinner. Oh, it was fun. She's a good kid. You were great thanks. with her. You know something? You're going to make a really great father someday. Yeah, I gotta learn how to hold down a job first. <laughs> what do you mean? You have a great job. Yeah, but just because I work for my father doesn't mean it's guaranteed for life. I gotta earn my keep. You earn your keep? I thought you said that working for the family business was a perfect fit, like an old pair of shoes. Yeah, well, I think I'm starting to take things for granted. What do you mean? Something happened? Do you remember this morning when I said I had to go and you kind of grabbed me by the arm and said, oh, no, you don't. Mm, don't remind me of that, Dylan. I might just attack you right here. I missed a meeting this morning. Tex Oil, one of our biggest clients. Billy had to cover for me. I think we need to have a little talk. Well, according to the latest focus groups, I have picked up 12 percentage points in the last two days. Mm. The people who used to be for the opposition seem to be having second thoughts. Mm -hmm. Can you look at this guy? One short week and he is looking at six more years in Washington. Six years during which I will not forget the helping hand that paved the way. Put it here, pal. Well, thank you, pal, but uh, you're shaking the wrong hand. This is one you should be thanking. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Chuckle, chuckle, chuckle. Just laugh it up, guys. You know something? I really don't have to deal with this. Wait now, Hank. Where are you going? Darling, why is it that I have to water and feed and entertain people who simply want to put me out of business, you know? There are other places that they could go and dance around and slap each other on the back. This is not the only restaurant in this town. Hamp, you're the owner here, and you can kick out whomever you want. We mm -hmm. just know that you'd be doing Roger a favor. He likes public scenes. Do you want to give him that satisfaction? <laughs> and besides, whatever her fault, Holly does not want to put you out of business. She should have thought of that before she gave the photographs to the Inquisitor. Whoa. Holly did that? Thought it was Roger, didn't you? But not this time. Yeah, listen, hun, sweetheart. Did you really have to tell him that? Please, uh, excuse me. How is it? Hi. Oh, hi. Thanks. Thanks. Music hi. is wonderful tonight. Oh, well, great, great. I'm glad everybody's having a good time. So, it uh, might make it uh, easy for you to do me a favor. Sure. What can I do for you? Would you please leave my club? Make your hair beautiful, with Preference by L'Oreal. It gives me shining color and nothing conditions better. So buck up, develop an attitude. I sure did. Just say, I'm worth it. Rich Conditioning Preference by L'Oreal. Surprise! It's Nature Valley Granola Bites. A bite-sized version of that delightful Nature Valley Granola Bar. This could be the candy bar nature intended in Bites. These are all good cleaners, but did you know that not one of them disinfects? So you don't get your home totally clean until you use Lysol Deodorizing Cleaner. Lysol cleans and kills germs without any extra effort. Germs can be anywhere, so don't do part of the job. Lemon Fresh Lysol Deodorizing Cleaner cleans and disinfects.
Ghostly odors popping up to haunt your home? Get into the spirit of the islands with Love My Carpet Tropical Blossoms. It'll help you get rid of unpleasant odors while the scent of a tropical garden fills the room. Try Love My Carpet Tropical Blossoms and get into the spirit. Do you know what my favorite country is? Country Sand Lysol Spray. There's not another country like it. I wouldn't change my country for a million bucks. Country Scent Lysol Disinfectant Spray is a refreshing blend of country fragrances in a disinfectant spray. Isn't it time you move to a new country? I love this country. Kmart's got a great price on Regina Upright. 8.2 amp motor, the attachments all fit in the back, and it's got a dirt search headlight. You have to search for dirt? In my house, it's right out in the open. We've got a great price on the Sharp VCR. Four heads, on-screen displays, very easy to program. I'm sure it is. And if I have trouble programming it, he can help me. No problem, Dad. That's adorable. This store is looking better and better all the time. Isn't that great? Right. What in the world is going on? He's her missing son, their missing brother. They have him look at me like that, like I was a complete stranger. <laughs> and worst of all, he's her missing husband. They're expecting me to give them something I just can't give them right now. Now why in the world would you miss it? This week, as the world turns. I was about to say, you've got to be kidding, but you look like you really want me out of here. Yes, I really do. <laughs> Listen, uh, to my eye, Ms. Lindsay's a paying customer who is politely minding her own business, which is more than can be said for you. It's okay, Roger. Look, I don't intend to argue with you, but can you tell me why you want me out of here? I really don't think you want me to spell that out in front of all these people. I've got nothing to hide. Holly, this has nothing to do with you. Mr. Speaks has made it clear in the past that he doesn't care for me, or for that matter, the company that you're keeping. You know, you're very right, Flynn. I don't really care very much for you or, or the company that she's keeping, but this has nothing to do with that. I have a very special grievance with Miss Lindsay. Do you have a problem with that? Roger. Oh, no, I don't. Polly. Look, I'm not so dumb that I think that even though you've been lucky enough to have a child, that there won't be problems with that child. But you know, part of being a family is is really about taking care of problems within the family when those problems arise, you know? You don't hang your flesh and blood out to dry in public and then go out dancing with your cohorts. Not my club, anyway. I'll drive you home. Yes, I will. Thanks for the family value speech. Consider running for office, or maybe you ought to get your own call-in talk show. The big market on intolerance these days, you know, they, they'll even pay you to sit in a studio with a bank of phones and just take pot shots at anybody you like without having a clue as to what they've endured in their lives. I mean, it sounds right up your alley. Lady, are you sure all of this stuff is just for one little crib? Well, there's a bassinet, too. Didn't I say that? No, you didn't. And now, we don't know which little parts go to which thing. And I'm also real thirsty, because that three-alarm chili's going down more like five or six alarm. Oh, okay. But I loved it! <laughs> uh, Bill, would you like a hamburger? Uh, no thanks. Here you go. How are we supposed to thanks. read this thing? Well, aren't those the directions? Uh -huh. And they're in Japanese. Why don't you, uh, translate them, Mama-san? <laughs> You're smart, Alec. There's another set in English. Where is it? Oh, okay. Here. Um. Okay, selecting rails of A and B. Attach knot. Attach knot? Well, yeah, that's what it says. Um, I guess that means that you have to be real careful not to get rails A and B together. No, no, Nadine, no, look, I don't think it means that at all. Well, sure. Attach knot, like, um, like... Want not, waste not, waste not, want not. <laughs> nuts. Yeah, that's my sentiment. Nuts. <laughs> no, no. I mean, that's the word. Nuts. You know, they say attach not, they mean attach nut. I know. George, I think he's got it. <laughs> you see, I said he had aptitude. Yeah, we better have it. it. takes us this much time to figure out these directions. We're going to be here all night putting this together. Well, if that's the case, I better get us some ice cream and cookies. Okay. There. Sally must have had a good day.
day. She's zonked. Yeah, she's great. so hard. 
hard reading all those directions. Why can you believe it? I mean, direction like, make sure perforations are strenuous. <laughs> oh, you're fun, Billy. You really are. And you don't even have to work at it. You just are. Well, truth is, I had a lot of fun tonight. Really? Would I lie to a pregnant woman? <laughs> no. <laughs> hey, here he is. Okay, you ready to go, handyman? Yep. Ready to go. Thanks for dinner and stuff. Oh, anytime, Bill. We'll see ya. Anytime. Good night.
cure for the disease of illiteracy is the restoration of intensive systematic phonics in every classroom in America. Learn to read with Hooked on Phonics, the musical reading program. Then, read to learn with SRA reading comprehension used by over 60 million people. Hooked on Phonics works for me. Call 1-800-ABCDEFG. I've got a really good story for you, and it's all about me. Who looks exactly the way that I look? Me. Sesame Street's Big Bird Story Magic from Tyco with storybook and cassette. The way your kid reacts to them speaks for itself. Um, <clears throat> do you have any butcher's blend? No. Butcher's burger? No. You sure you're a butcher? Yeah. Don't bother the oh. butcher. What oh. you want is in the dog food aisle. Oh. See? Oh, so it is. For a meaty taste and variety of flavors, try new Butcher's Blend brand dog food or new Butcher's Burger brand made with real beef. But please, don't bother the butcher. Nice doggy. Say something. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> That's good for a start. That's even better. Man, if someone told me this morning that I could feel this good tonight. Life is full of these wonderful surprises. Hmm. Well, let's hear it for life. Didn't you know this was going to happen sooner or later? No, you knew. I was too worried about what I would do if it didn't happen. Well, you should listen to me more often. <laughs> didn't I tell you I can't listen to you? I'm deaf. You're deaf, like a fox. You're getting so good at this that you're starting to read my mind and my lips. That's right. I know all and see all, so you better watch it. Matter of fact, I'm beginning to read your mind right now. you can 
can forgive Blake for sleeping with someone who's your worst enemy when I cannot forgive her for sleeping with someone who used to be my friend. Well, there's forgiving and there's forgiving. <laughs> I love it when you're totally obscure. Well, what I mean is maybe I haven't forgiven her as completely as you think. Look, you warned me that before I congratulate myself too thoroughly on her loyalty, that maybe I should test it, and I decided that wasn't such a bad idea. What are you going to do? Well, what I'm not going to do is involve you. All right. But I promise I will give you an update when she passes. And if she fails? That too. But I would request that this little Freedom of Information Act we got going between us flows both ways. That is, if you know something about Chrissy that you have reason to believe I don't, that's important that you'll share it with me. Seems fair. Shall we shake on it? Do we? for Kimmy or me. <gasps> Mom! I remember loving my dollhouse more than anything. It was a really special part of my childhood. I wanted Kimmy to have that experience. And the Play School dollhouse lived up to all those expectations. Shh, the baby's asleep. It's really beautiful. Has lots of nice furniture. Comes with a very nice family. It even has a nightlight that plays a lullaby. And most important, Kimmy's crazy about it. Amazingly, most people in America have never heard of this product. Tylenol Sinus. The strength you need from the name you trust. Gas pressure means pain and bloating. And the way doctors see it, your best choice for relief is Mylanta Gas. It has the best medicine for gas. On the eve of the election... I'm gonna run for mayor. Scandal rocks Rome, Wisconsin. Isn't it true you engaged in an adulterous affair? Tearing the town... I know who it is. ...and the Brock family apart. I won't vote for you. Anytime I've achieved anything in my career, flattens out our sex life. A special Picket Fences Friday. This has been Guiding Light. Hosiery by Donna Karen. Good afternoon from CBS News. This is Newsbreak. The Food and Drug Administration has approved the drug Depo-Provera for use as a contraceptive injection. One shot would prevent pregnancy for three months. President Bush and Bill Clinton are campaigning all out in key Midwestern states, with new polls showing the governor ahead by anywhere from two to ten points nationwide. And Israeli TV says Jordan and Israel have drawn up a document in which Jordan, for the first time, declares its willingness to sign a peace treaty with Israel. Now this. Taste a whole new kind of Welch's grape juice. Introducing Welch's grape juice blends. 100% juices with no sugar added. Mmm. This is an only grape. It's grape and apple. Extraordinary blends with all the rich, full taste of Welch's grape juice and other natural fruit juices. I've got peaches in my grape juice. New Welch's grape juice blends. Take the time to taste the Welch's. I'm Jacqueline Adams, CBS News. Tonight on the Evening News, Eye on America investigates chemicals in carpets that could be making you sick. This is CBS. Do you need a bigger TV, a better stereo, furniture, appliance?